So today we are going to pick up a new puppy. I'm so excited. So my older Chihuahua, who is almost 11 years old, is at home right now. Um, so they'll also meet for the first time today. Okay, so I just got the Chihuahua. Oh my god, look how cute she is. Hi. Oh my goodness. She's so cute. Oh my god. Okay, put your hand on top of her face just to show you the size. Mm -hmm. what? Like, look, look that. I don't know. Look, look at her head and compared to Kelvin's hand. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So the um, lady at Solar gave us like a bowl some toys, a jacket, which is actually a really nice jacket, and then some other toys. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Nina's gonna meet her. She's so small. Yeah, she's tiny. Hi. Hi, it's okay. No shaking. Hi. Okay. Well, Kevin's gonna dry it and I'm just gonna cuddle and hold her because she's shaking. Hi! Hello! This is my new baby. <laughs> her head is literally just resting on Kevin's chest. She's tired. Oh my goodness, she's tired. Are you just gonna keep her hand there? I don't know why she's. She was trying to find the per. She kept moving because she was trying to find the perfect position. I guess this is the perfect position. <laughs> okay, so we're just on our way home. We're just picking up some bubble tea, but anyways, um. So what I read or seen on YouTube is that you're supposed to let two dogs meet. In a neutral space this is me planning for how to do it with nina how to how to introduce them and so yeah so you're supposed to let them meet in a neutral space because the house is nina's territory so i was thinking of taking them to the dog park but she doesn't have any of her shots yet so i don't think i should take her to a dog park because i don't think that's allowed or definitely not recommended anyways um, so we're not going to do that, but there is like a basketball court near my house. So Calvin's going to take her. Um, Calvin's going to take her and then I'm going to go get Nina and walk over to the, uh, to the basketball court. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, so Calvin has gone to the park now. I'm just coming home to grab Nina. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, let's go. I'm so nervous. I don't even know where I Do I have the keys? Yeah, I do. So, Nina doesn't usually go to the dog park. The, the dog park, the basketball area park. So, Let's go, Nina. Let's go. I'm so nervous for her. I don't even know why. I think I just really want them to like each other. Oh my goodness. Kelvin just like let the puppy go. He's over there. Go on. Okay, you can put her down now. Oh my goodness, is this the most adorable thing she ever? She hasn't barked yet. That's crazy. Oh, Nina, calm down. Oh, the puppy's shaking. I think she's cold. Okay. Nina's watering though, babe. Yeah? Like, her mouth is watering. What do you mean? Like she has dripping mat watering. <laughs> okay, babe, I think let's go because the puppy's really cold.
Be nice, Nina. Okay, let's go. I have never seen that from Nina before. <laughs> okay, okay, the dog, the puppy's so cold. I think that went pretty well. Yeah. Like, I think that went really well. Nina barks at everything. At everything. She even barks at people just walking past our house. So. I think that went really, really well. That's <laughs> really crazy. Like, I don't know if she was getting mad though because she was starting to drool. <laughs> You know how like when somebody's angry, <laughs> they start drooling? I don't know, is that a thing? <laughs> Anyways, she didn't bark. That's a good sign. Okay, well now it's time to be in the house. We had to cut it short because it's really, the puppy was getting cold. Cause chihuahuas get cold really easily. Look at Nina. This is so interesting. That is so interesting. Like we didn't really didn't know what to expect at all. Nina's curious. The little puppy's a little scared. I think Nina is a little upset, but she's not doing too much. Oh my goodness. Technically, so I can see Nina's tail is up and her hair in the it's like at down. the top is not up. Yeah. Usually when she's really mad, she like the middle like or what's it called spine yeah. is standing up the hair but this one isn't this time it isn't she did kind of put her paw on top of the puppy and the puppy is a little scared but she's not shaking anymore or she still is a little bit so nina had like some thing coming out of her mouth like what's it called what did i say it was Foam. Like foaming in her mouth, so I didn't know what would that mean. Like, is she mad? Is she what? But she's not barking or she's not being aggressive, so that's good. Um, we googled what it means, and apparently, it's like she's stressed right now or having like a little bit of anxiety. So, we're just letting her be, right? Both of them. So far, so good, honestly. Nina's just very, very curious about the puppy. So, name for the dog, as of right now, it is Panda. That could change any time, but as of right now, her name is Panda. I will let you guys know if I, we change it. Okay, so Nia still hasn't barked, but now she's, and she stopped foaming in the mouth, but now she's crying. <laughs> there you go, so Kevin's showing her more love right now. But she wants to go check out the dog. But then all Nina wants is just check out the dog. So it hasn't been even 30 minutes and the puppies already seem comfortable. She is exploring, biting stuff already. <laughs> And kind of playing with Nina already. She was really scared earlier though. Right now she's not. Oh, I can't wait to take pictures of them. I think Nina, you know, she's tired. Yeah, but she knows that she's small enough she can fit into like a weird spot. And Nina, Nina can't touch her. So Panda just went on Nina's bed and She's like right in the middle. Like we got her a bed which is downstairs. I don't know if I should just go get it. Okay, so Nina definitely does not like it that she's sleeping in her bed. So we're gonna go get the other bed that we got for her. Look at her. <laughs> I'm really so excited when they can actually share a bed. 
me, she's much more calm. <laughs> here, here, see? Need. That's your bed. I know it's so big on you. That's Nina's bed and that's your bed. Oh, do you like that bed better? But that's Nina's bed. Do you want that bed too? Oh no, babe. babe. <laughs> she likes that bed. What about this bed? I bought this one for you. Oh, I guess I have to buy that bed Wait a too. Let's just see what happens. Let's just see how annoyed Nina gets. Nina just lied down. Well, kind of. Panda's like at the very edge, <laughs> and Nina's back in her spot. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They're almost sharing a bed. Not really sleeping. They are sharing a bed, Reese. They're not even almost. They're totally sharing a bed. But I bought this bed. <laughs> I bought this bed for you, Panda. Wait, do I like this bed better? Or do I like another bed better? The breeder gave me that toy for the puppy, for Panda, and Nina just took it. Oh man. <laughs> also, Panda's now sleeping inside there. I don't know if you can tell because she's in this one sleeping up right here. <laughs> Hopefully, maybe Nina will forget for a bit so that the puppy can sleep. I know she's moving. Oh yeah, this is the one. So, I got this bed from PetSmart for $25. That bed was a bit more expensive. I got that one for Nina for Christmas. I think it was $40 or $50 actually. She loves that bed though. And apparently Panda likes it too. But Nina. Someday I'm sure they'll be able to share. Playing with her toy while technically it was Panda's toy. And Panda was sleeping and Nina totally flipped the bed. Well, I guess Panda wasn't really sleeping, but... I think she was, she was sleeping. Sleeping or resting. But Panda's not shaking anymore. I think she's just annoyed. No, she's definitely sleeping. She just yawned. And tired. Nina, did you know she was sleeping? <laughs> Nina, she's sleeping. Let her sleep, please. Annoying big sister. That's Nina. The pup panda is literally resting, sleeping, because she's tired. Oh, good <laughs> Okay, so panda's nails are, are really long and sharp, so I feel like I really need to um, trim them. Her nails are luckily white, so clear, so I can see the, I forgot what it's called, but the vein. So hopefully maybe I'll do it tonight or tomorrow. We'll see. Oh, also, Panda peed on the pee pad on her first date. She already peed on the carpet earlier, but she peed on the pee pad on the second time. Yay! Some breeders are actually really good at training them on pee pads right away, but I guess I didn't show her earlier where the pee pads were yet. But now she knows. So annoying. Look what she's doing. The puppy just wants to sleep. And she's dragging the puppy's bed up. This bed was all the way over there by the coffee table. <laughs>